guess I've found out tonight that Mr. Stratton can uh, control the rain. Uh, <laughs> wish he could do that four years later. <laughs> well, um, i got to say, over the years, I've come to realize that the key to success is really about the people around you and you know, the people that put you in a position to succeed. So, first of all, my parents, Jack and Jackie, thank you for your unwavering love and support. Never missed a game, never missed anything, any kind of activity. Terrific role models and parents and now grandparents. Uh, many fond memories of Bonner. Uh, some of the teachers, uh, a couple I can name. Mr. Saladone, who was actually here. I'll mention a failure warning he gave me senior year. Uh, Mr. Griffith, Mr. Enblom, to name a few. I mean, these are really great guys, and I gotta tell you, I, my kids, oh, they went to Bonner, uh, two of my kids anyway, and, and I tell people that uh, I really enjoyed going to school. I really did. It was something I really look forward to. But there are many coaches throughout uh, as well. Mr. Stratton, Mr. Ben, very instrumental in, in our uh, team. I mean, personally, we won the Catholic League Southern Division our senior year. And uh, one of my more memorable moments was actually uh, going to graduation in my baseball uniform. You know, we got a police escort down to Veterans Stadium, and uh, unfortunately, Mr. Stratton didn't do his rain dance, and uh, we lost fire on him. But it's a really, truly memorable experience. Any teammates uh, and friends, people like uh, Mike Mitchell, Gary Nolan, Mike Lombardi, Ted Kukowski, who's here. Uh, I know these guys since grade school, and they're great teammates and friends, and, uh, you know, those of you who play sports, you know, you, you, you win as a team, you lose as a team, and uh, these guys are great teammates and, and even better friends. Um, as you see, I have uh, had the pleasure of helping uh, raise five children who I love dearly, and uh, very proud of them. Referred to him as the Brady Bunch minus one. Um, and the mothers really deserve a lot of credit for, for how they turned out. They're really great kids. And uh, very happy that Jeff and John can be here tonight uh, to share the night with me. Uh, they're both Bonner graduates and they share the passion that I have for, for Bonner as well. My other three children, as you saw, um, I think they mentioned Trisha. But Trisha, my daughter, is in Germany. She's actually on a six month assignment. Uh, following her dad's footsteps, I guess, internationally. Um, steps on Matt is a senior at the uh, Naval Academy, and he couldn't get to leave tonight. So he had, a, he had to watch the football game today and watch Pittsburgh uh, in their club. Um, my stepdaughter, Caitlin, she's studying abroad. Um, she's in Australia, which uh, hopefully I can arrange a business trip or maybe meet her in a couple of weeks. Um, the last person I really like to acknowledge is my wife, Tori. Um, she's put up with me for the last 17 years. Uh, my job requires a great deal of international travel. And uh, she's always, uh, always been the understanding that a great deal uh, that I'm away from home is really just part of the job and something I really need to do. And, uh, you know, the times I was home with all the softball and coaching I did, uh, you know, I really think she needs to be canonized. Um, I'm often reminded by people that run into talk about the small world. Uh, Mike Mitchell is also in the insurance industry. And people run into him, you know, somebody will come up to me and say, hey, Mike Mitchell, and I ran into Mitch, and uh, he said to remind you, as a pitcher, you would have been nothing without your catcher. And I probably would have agreed with him as uh, an ornery 18-year-old, but, uh, you know, when you really think about it, he's right. And it really is, uh, it comes down to it, it really is all about the people that uh, help put you in a position to succeed. And uh, I really thank God for surrounding me with those people over the years. Uh, in closing, congratulations to all the uh, other inductees and the others being honored tonight. And to Tom Meekham, who I understand nominated me, and the members of the committee, I thank you for this great honor. I'm really, truly humbled to be part of the whole.